this is A, that's going to be B, and back to C. <coughs> the question here is to find the unknown support reaction. So we're looking at finding the unknown forces at point A, that's a fixed support, and at point C, that's a roller. Then in between at point B, this is a internal hinge. So that's a <coughs> Problems. So if I draw the free body, okay, that's point A, that's point B, and that's point C. And we start looking at, let's say, the reactions, then there'll be reaction AX, <coughs> there's going to be a reaction AY, and it's a fixed support. See, add a couple, which is unknown, and that's going to be, let's say, M, A. <coughs> then we have C, that's a roller. You're going to place another reaction. Plus you have a force here, that's 2,500 Newton. So that's just the direct free body diagram for this problem. <coughs> and again, we look at the unknowns here. You have AX, AY. M A and C Y. So that gives you <coughs> basically three, four unknowns. Or four unknown forces. And you only have three equations of equilibrium. So the way I've drawn the <coughs> free body diagram you really have more unknowns than the equation. But we can use the logic I just described, which means we look at each component by itself. 